Hello and welcome to my channel. Today we are previewing the upcoming English Premier League Match Day 13 match of the week between Chelsea and Manchester United. This fixture will of course be played at the legendary Stamford Bridge, home of Chelsea and West London. That stadium does feature on the virtual red patch that I use, so we have it for you here in the preview. Here's a look at the Stamford Bridge. Festivities. Let's take a look at our starting lineups. For Chelsea, a little bit of a strange lineup because of depth issues at striker. The 3 4 3 Kai Havertz takes that role. Pulisic and Ziyech on the other side. Manchester United in their 4 2 3 1. Their Nick Fred double pivot over the back line. Cavani up top. Paul Ben Bruno's going to spot there. Good strange line for the AI side here. So I'm not sure why they're doing what they're doing, but let's see what happens. Alright, here's a look at our winter. Thank you, Flight English Premier League ball. We are underway. Stamford Bridge. Ball, Conte in behind, goal for Chelsea, sixth minute. Great ball in behind. Conte seems to have just kind of run around the back line. Now we take a look at his path there. Ball in the Vibers. That was just going to be behind. Van de Saka. started pretty poorly and these two sides, those two sides have kind of changed places recently. Kai Havertz shot is blocked as De Gea comes off his line. Hunt does a good job of holding up just enough to allow that to happen. Arsenal Oh my goodness! Goal from Cavani, a quick answer for Manchester United. Edinson Cavani, the Uruguayan striker extraordinaire. Assisted by Pogba, that'd be about his millionth assist this year. so presumably they'll be all right. But I also say there's a reason that Mendy is starting over him. Keppa came in and uh, won that shootout in the Super Cup, so maybe he's got a... Uh, still got something left to give. 
Zia Cheer, the Moroccan, who they were also they will also be doing with that during the African Cup of Nations in January. Into February, depending on how those respective spots go. Everts in some space. And he finishes 2 1 Chelsea. and go somewhere else. We're inside the first half hour and we've got three goals at this point. Champions League final when he we got some nice pass from this affair and catch it out. Skillful that was. That's why he's getting his boot shine. Alright, two on Chelsea. We're just come up on the half hour mark. Already a ton of action in front of the goal here. Terrible pass. Oh no! Pulisic intercepts and my fellow American can't convert. Suwan Bissaka. Is that Lindelof? Really awful pass there. Pulisic can't convert. It's two on Chelsea. for a goal every 10 minutes there. That would have been our goal for the, the 40th minute. It wasn't to be. I don't think we're going to get one here. I don't think there's enough time left to get down. Yeah, maybe there is. Havertz got to that first. He got a good chance on another one. But hey, it sends it out. It's going to end in the first half. Goals for Angola Conte, Edison Cavani, and Kai Havertz. Two on Chelsea at the half. Let's take a look at our halftime stats. Not a big difference, <laughs> apart from the shots, of course, which are pretty important in the possession stats, but Chelsea have obviously made much more of their time of possession than United have, so we'll see what kind of tactical adjustment we get from United here in the second half as they look to scratch back an equalizer. Already equalized once, we'll see how they respond here in the second half. Protest too much there, but gives a look. That's some doorway back to get that one. Jorginho to Cate. Mason Mount. Such an important, versatile player for Chelsea. Ooh, bumped off. Bumped off his run there. Yeah, he had a ton of space to run through there. And it gets bumped off as well. Got 
Drew out on the right wing and Pogba in the attacking midfield spot. I think if anything, it swapped those two. AI is going to do what the AI is going to do. Kai Havertz in behind. Three more chances. conflict between France and Germany in the history of the world. Marcus Alonso on the Z-Edge. Prepared to see this one out. Hey, Livermento! It's a takeaway. See, I knew there was a reason I picked him. Bailly to Fred. Bruno Fernandez, Manchester United on the counter. Use it again in stoppage time now. Ooh. Taken away by Paul Pogba. Not much time left for Manchester United. That should do it. That's it from the Stanford Bridge. Chelsea 3, Manchester United 1. Goals for Ndolo Conte, Edinson Cavani, and two from that man. Man of the match, Kai Havertz. Let's take a look at our highlights. Right, this kicks us off. Six minutes in, he finds Ngolo Conte behind Wan Bissaka. He converts. minute. Lindelof holds him up just enough to let De Gea come off his line and knock that one down. Fred gets things moving the other way. 20th minute. Paul Pogba finds Edinson Cavani. Zuma turns it the wrong way there and Cavani finishes. 25th minute. Hakeem Ziyech. Takes a pop from distance, he's off the mark. 29th minute, my fellow American, Christian Pulisic. Really nice pass there. Kai Havertz, cool, precise finish in the side net. Take a look at this pass from Pulisic, nice work there. So smooth, I didn't even catch it in real time. 40th minute, this really should have been another terrible pass from Lindelof. Pulisic intercepts right around the spot, can't put it on frame. 77th minute, Kai Havertz. Bailly intercepts very briefly, Kai Havertz takes it right off his boot, knocks it home. 
that's it for this one from the Stamford Bridge. If you enjoy the video, please give it a like. If there's a fixture you'd like to see me play, you can leave it in the comments. If you enjoy this type of content, please subscribe to my channel for more. Again, thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed, and we'll see you next time.